right there, of course, was a tribute to the 2003 Billings Blazers hockey team who won the provincial and GMAA championships 20 years ago, and that was my first year of high school. That was my first year of high school. I'm actually shocked how quickly life comes at you. That was the pass, and this is the present. Billings with a chance to win the championship. There's a steal. Score! <laughs> seconds into the game seven seconds that might be the quickest start I have ever seen Canel wins the draw and scores seven seconds into the game folks and college Notre Dame's on their heels one nothing Blazers Canel behind the net sounds in front and that's blocked Two columns today for the from the junior team. Brody Young and Sago Nigarawi Staibo, who's on the fence. And now stolen by Notre Dame, played up the center ice. Puck uh, hung along the wall. And there's the takeaway. And here comes Notre Dame. And that is turned aside by Hill. Puck comes loose, and it's picked up by Calais Notre Dame. One nothing Blazers on a goal by Canal. Seven seconds into this game, we played just over a minute up to this point. Marcus Dibo banks one high off the glass, settled in, and the feet across was stuffed out. Billings on a change. And it's brought back in by Calais Notre Dame. And now taken by the Blazers, fed up. And that's going to be knocked away from Perez. Brought back in by the Blazers. That's Marquis. Likes Marquis. One of the Gondolagan order on this team. Uh, it was great to see a couple of buddies from high school on. Both Scott Colosimo and assistant coach uh, Jordan Dewey, who has got a nice and call here. Both, uh, both players, uh, I had the opportunity to get to know well in high school. And Scott was my best friend actually in elementary school, so it's like a 25 year friendship between Scott and I. Face off one by the Blazers. Shot from the point, sent wide. Sago Nigurawi's Daibo on the point. He's number 20, the call up from the junior team, or from the, yeah, the junior team. Pass across, hits a skate, and that'll get out of the zone. <coughs> Sago Nigurawi lets a shot go. That's Dom. I the last time we saw him, the Blazers, uh, Beat College St. Anne by a score of 6 0. That was back in November. Daibo had a goal on a seeing eye shot. Three Blazers defensemen had tallies in that game. Off the draw, save, rebound, set wide. And Canell has the goal for the Blazers. Daniel Muradov in nets for Colley St. Anne. Here's a wrist shot, and Muradov catches this one through a little bit of traffic. And play is halted. If you're from Colley St. Anne, sorry, there are a couple of last names here, which uh, I'm not going to lie, I'm going to have a hard time with. Theo de Zacos, that's one of them. He wears number 39 for Colley St. Anne. Kept in by Burnett. Burnett trying to find the handle, and it's sent up to center ice. Here comes Jack Wolo, sending one wide of the net, and the puck goes back behind the goal. Picked up by St. Anne. A centering feed, blocked behind the net. Caleb Mirage Sullivan behind that goal. 
trying to protect. We got a penalty coming up to the Blazers. Comes back to the point. Shot back into Billings territory, and we have the game's first penalty. I hit at a checking call. Illegal body check. Uh, if you're wondering, this league is semi-contact. And it is uh, Caleb Sullivan going off. Caleb Moran Sullivan, two minutes or less here. And we'll see if Collier St. Diane can pounce. Lindshiner up there, along with Romain Lelouch, number 82, who had the puck go his way. Hayden Craig cut it off and shot it out of the zone. Pontapayev's on the PK along with uh, Luciano Croce. Sent out in front of the net. Loosened the slot and played away from danger. The penalty kill's gone well up to this point. 35 seconds in, the Blazers have a short-handed tally. They have a 2-0 lead, and they have College Notre Dame on the ropes right now. Shot up. Netminder kept it or put it around. Croce ties up. And now Noah Hill comes in. Hill. Does a good job. And now Colleys Notre Dame has to come back. Into Billings territory. Back to the point it comes. Intercepted, played off the wall. That hits the high stanchion, stays in play. 2-0 Blazers. Lex Markley has the latest goal, a short-handed tally. Now in the high slot, a shot. Hits something, it sails out of play. Two nothing, Billings lead. As you mentioned, Blazers are two call-ups. Brody Young and Sago Nicaragua Sago. Both of those guys uh, play for the junior team. Face off one by Notre Dame. Pass in front, the flex, elevates up in the air, a shot from a sharp angle, blocked her down. That was Don Paveso, the netminder for the Blazers tonight. And he comes up with a nice blocker stop, stolen behind the net by Boone. And Boone threw it out in front, that is knocked down. Here comes Philippousis. And Philippousis has it knocked away. Boone turning on the Jets. Boone coming in. Boone all alone. Boone. And he's turned aside. off one by the Blazers. Comes back to the point. Puck deflected on route. And Notre Dame gets it up and out of the zone. This of course is U18 hockey. 
Stolen puck. And that'll be chipped wide. Or actually, it'll land on it. And force Paveso to make the stop. Play it up the wall. So we are five on five here. Right, here come the Blazers, backhander! And that is kept out by Duradov. Back to the point it comes. A wrister, go! Blazers trying to press. Perez is tied up. Emilio Perez keeps it in the zone. Outworking two Notre Dame defenders. <laughs> What? what was and unbelievably this is going to be an offensive zone faceoff no nope. icing wave all right that's going to go on the top loopers of the year comes out in front of the net intercepted by the Blazers. that's the most random thing i've seen in a while there. and noah hill gets it up that comes Notre Dame, and that pass is intercepted, chopped wide of the net. To the point it goes. Stolen puck, Nicholas Stab. Had it chipped off his stick. Stab going to war in the corner, right in front of the penalty box. Played up to center ice. There's a good, good little shoulder thrown. By Hayden Craig. Patapayev trying to get through. Here comes Boone. Shooting one wide of the net. And that's intercepted by Notre Dame. The tour trying to get it out. And it's played and intercepted by Craig and he'll send. Notre Dame back deep in their own end. Stole the puck. Marcus Dybo. Two Blazers in the right, same spot. And that will result in a turnover. And away comes Notre Dame. A wrist shot. Not on. Back to the point it goes. A wrister, and that's deflected by a back checking young. And that was Zachary Durham on the back check, number 24. Dean White. Played off the board, Bakapaya. Back up to center ice, Marcus Daibo. Beautiful move, Daibo. Tied up, Daibo. And he gets a shot away. No penalty coming up. Back in Howard, uh, back in Gunawagi's sports complex. Howard is building up 2 nothing against Notre Dame. A wrist shot, walk it away. By Paveso, 5.35 left to play in the first period. Kicked out, follow-up chance, lands on the pads of Paveso who makes the save. Other gone to in order is today's backup that minor Damon Paul. And there's a feed up. And away comes HSB. What a toe drag! And that's shot wide. And it comes, and the shot was deflected on route, landed very softly on that. Burnett fans on it, and Notre Dame has an opportunity to get back. Now the Blazers can chase it. Mitchell Cannell, one of the two goals. He's got it now for the Blazers. Pass up in the high slot, take it away, and Notre Dame gets it. All right, Canel scored seven seconds into this game, and this is going to be deflected off of his shin and out of play. Mitchell Canel and Lex Markley have the goals for the Blazers, and they have a 2 0 lead here. Off one by Notre Dame. Lelush. Lelush. Not able, or he was able to get by one of the Blazers. 
Backhander, and that is knocked away. Good stop. Back on front of the net, intercepted and sent around the horn. Played up, and Cannell trying to get in behind the defense. Mitchell Cannell, one on one, and he dragged it behind the net. Intercepted by the Blazers. Here's a backhander sticked away. And Cannell's going back to the bench, favoring, it looks like his uh, left rib cage area. <laughs> Two nothing Billings leading here with 349 left to go in period one. Lex Markley has the goal which has widened the gap to two. Mitchell Cannell, the other goal for the Blazers. Billings in white with gold and blue and Notre Dame in the dark blue kind of, remember those really, those really dark National Predators jerseys, so like the 07-08 season. That's how I see it. Philippousis. Back behind his own net, trying to get started. That's a dangerous area to try and put the puck up the middle. And now it's regained by Cole. Stolen puck. Wrister by Perez. Blocker saved by the netminder Miradov. And away comes Notre Dame. Across center ice they go. There's a deflection and it's sent back behind the net by Jack Wolos, number seven. And the Blazers intercepted, clear it. This puck is going to roll very gingerly down the ice. Icing waved off. I actually feel like Notre Dame could have touched that puck at center ice. Stolen puck. Here come the Blazers. What a stop as the puck trickles through. Again. Puck trickled through, but. Miradov got just enough of it. Now with the flex on net, Miradov forced to kick it out. And the Blazers got College Notre Dame running around here. Making them look like they're fishing, but without a hole. Not usually recommended for ice fishing anyway. And there's a stolen puck at center ice by LeClaire. Poked up, and Mark Simon with a beautiful pass. Break away, oh, that is stopped by Muradov. Turning away, Ryan Boone. Yeah, this is a beautiful 120 foot pass. Sorry, a beautiful 100 foot pass from Marcus Naibo, right on the stick of Ryan Boone. He just wasn't able to beat Muradov, and you know what? I have to say, since Billings took the 2-0 lead, Miradov has been dynamite in nets for his Notre Dame. But he's been excellent. Brought in by Notre Dame. Here's a wrist shot, pinballs off a stick and then lands behind the net in the mess. Blazers, Mitchell Cannell and Lex Markley, the goal scorer. <coughs> Given away, 2 on one and that wrist shot was wide of the net. Now, one-timer. Going against the grain, and they're not able to hit it. Here come the Blazers. Shot, save! That's Muradov again. Burnett. Markry set it behind the goal. Final minute of play in the first. Markry kicks it out. And Germ shoots, not on. Final 50. Centering feed, stuffed out. Markley trying to crash the net. His backhander didn't hit it. And now it comes back out to Burnett. 
Burnett with the lane and his shot is blocked. He didn't use the lane though. I think he tried to put it through traffic. Rather than maybe go up to the lane he sees and shoot it from there. 27 seconds to go in the period. 2-0 Billings. And that's played up. Burnett with the steal at center ice and he'll shoot it deep. Croce going after the puck. He's got it. Croce. But he's tripped penalty coming up. Three seconds to go. Extra attacker out and it's banged upon. And that is period one. Billings has a 2 0 lead. They'll carry that momentum into period two with a full power play to work with as well. This is it. Billings leading 2 0, and they will start this period on the power play. Canell and Markwe, the goals for the Blazers in that first period. This is their first opportunity with the man advantage, and Miradov gets rid of it. Yeah, when you have a, a goaltender who can handle the puck like that, it really helps out. It almost kind of acts like a third defender, which is something that you need, especially when you're killing a penalty, if your goaltender can make a play like that. Boone in the slot trying to hit Hayden Craig. And the puck will glance out and Craig has to come back. Bybo. Burnett keeps it in at the point. Burnett. Oh, he found on it. That's offside. Uh, called on the Blazers. Fifty-nine to go here in the second period. No one's by two. Face off one by the Blazers. It's Suggeniger now. He's Nibo. And Billing shoots it in. Nibo holds it in. Played back behind the net. Stolen puck. Potapayev giving chase, and that's. <laughs> See, you're not allowed to catch the puck with your hand and move it. <laughs> oh, they're calling this one a penalty, which I think is actually the rule. You can't carry. And they're ruling that's what it was, so. McMahon is going off for two minutes here. And we now have four on four hockey for the next 34 seconds. to go in the second period. Face off one by Calais Notre Dame. There's a wrister. And Alessio's got it. <laughs> Blazers are going to make a switch here mid-shift. Right before the shift starts. Remember, Billings the home team, so they get the last change. Canell's coming on for Marcus Nybo. Hayden Craig to Canell. Canell for Boone. Boone. He fronts Beautiful! Craig on the finish on that tic-tac-toe effort. It's a four-on-four four goal. 
penalty to Notre Dame is now over, and the visitors will now go to work on the power play. Tipped down in the zone. Stolen puck by Perez, and he will hammer it down. Oh, stolen puck by the Blazers. McManus still has one minute left in his penalty. Perez the steal, and he'll get rid of it. Colleagues Notre Dame 0 for 1 on the PP. They've given up a short handed goal. Brought in, and a wrist shot. Pick back up and shot behind the Blazers' goal. Sagonigodawi Staibo with a rude awakening on one of the Notre Dame players. Tipped on net. Second score on the PP. Elliot Gay taking the draw for Notre Dame. One back to the point. 25 seconds to go in the power play. Vane in front. And that one time attempt actually hits off the skate of, Mick, of Craig and then lands on to Paveso, who keeps it out and keeps his baby 3-0. Face off one by Notre Dame. To the point it goes. Now it comes to the point. Power point over. Blazers have killed off both penalties here, uh, in which they faced today. And that would have been penalty number three, but obviously... Blazers leading here with 11.20 to go. There's a shot. No. Let's see if the Blazers can regroup here following uh, the penalty, uh, the successful penalty kill. Let's see if they keep building the momentum. <laughs> They're up 2 nothing after the first, and they have a goal here in the second. They play three 15-minute periods. I believe they will be flooding the ice during the second period intermission. Here comes Notre Dame. Wrist shot. That's locked away. Oh, Marcus Daimo introducing himself to Dabrowski. And boy, Dabrowski took a hard bump there. From uh, the hometown boy, Marcus Dybo. Canell, a shot, save made. Boone behind the net, and that swept out of danger and swept really far down, all the way down. Icing waved off. 10 to go in the second. That'll get by Noah Hill. He was hearing it from someone over here. 3-0 Blazers. And a face-off now coming back inside the building zone. Face-off won by St. Notre Dame. And that wrist shot will not give Pabeso any problems. of course wearing the blue machine jerseys. For shot, see me. And here comes 
Texans HSB. Getting across center right. And shooting one back into St. Anne or Notre Dame territory. Last time we saw this team, they were beating St. Anne. And of course, the, the junior team played against the Irish national team. That's the last time we saw a junior team. Second game for the senior team, which we featured here. Southern Eagle Alley's Bible in pursuit. Oh, he did it! Oh, that almost worked. Oh, I gotta appreciate the effort from Dybo. Notre Dame comes back. Shot comes in, and that'll be stopped by Pavacio. to the left of the Blazers' head. Uh, Patapaya will come in to take the draw after his center was waved. That was Boone. Our coach, sorry, that was waved. The Blazers win the draw regardless. Intercepted by the Blazers. Looking to attack. Now shot back into Billings territory. Oh, a big collision behind the net. It's so one of the Blazers went down. Here comes Craig. And he hits the butt end of the stick of Radoff. Shipped back in by Notre Dame. I'll just say, I'll just say that when the goalie makes a save with the butt end of the stick, that usually means you put the puck in a very good spot. Shaw back into Billings territory. Penalty coming up to the Blazers. There's a save. Interference to call on Billings. It is McManus visiting the Inman for a second time here. Billings has been in the penalty box two times today, and both times they scored goals while they had a guy in the box. Maybe this is the strategy. Cannell shoots it in. And they are 0 for 2 on the power play. Lex Marquis a shorthanded goal for the Blazers, which put them up two, and now they currently lead by three. A backhander played back to the point, and here's a good look. They slide it across, and that is a great save going post to post by Pavacio. And Pavacio poked it away in front, and the puck squirts free. Oh, Notre Dame had a wide open net if they were able to get the carom. Penalty coming up, yeah. Body checking on Notre Dame. And that'll make it four on four. <laughs> Let's see, it's number 11 for Notre Dame. And that is Joshua Dubrovsky. So Dubrovsky in the sin bin. It's now four on four for the next minute 16. Well, the Blazers scored the last time these two teams were four on four. That was Hayden Craig, who's on the ice right now. He has it. Craig slides it across. Here's a wrister. No. Keep it in. Craig holds his own. Marquis lets it go to Boom. Boom, behind the net. Sets up, Boom, takes a peek, and now 
and decides he's got better options at the point. Craig to Boone, and that is padded aside. Great stop by Miradov. What a hit on the far side of the ice. Ooh. Slides it across to Craig, and Craig shoots it down low. Boom. Back in front. Craig gets the pass. 17 seconds left in the Blazers penalty as the shot comes on. They're going to go on an abbreviated power play in 15 seconds. Face off one by the Calais uh, Notre Dame. That's kicked out. Daibo not able to catch up to Henry Latour. Latour doing a good job in there. 40 seconds left in a now Billings power play. Here's Canal with the Canet. Canal in front! Penalty coming up! And we've got Miradov down on the ice. This is dangerous for Notre Dame. They only have one goalie. They don't have a backup today. It's on the Blazers. I'll tell you what, when we see we see this on the replay. Noah Hill going hard to the net. It looked like he might have been assisted into the crease. But right now, I'm not able to watch the actual instant replay, so until I do that, I can only go with suspicion. And the suspicion is the Blazers don't like the call. Notre Dame likes the call. And the net, meanwhile, got dislodged on the other side of the ice. an open net for the entire game. Three nothing Blazers leading. And it's four on four for the next 16 seconds. And then Notre Dame will go to work on a power play. Craig took over it. Pass out in front. Banged off the boards. It's Craig who's down on his, his knees. Gets the puck. He's not really under any pressure. Notre Dame not pressuring. Billings now on a penalty kill. We pass the boom. In behind the defense back ever. Oh. Shot save. This kid is having itself one heck of a game in Nets for Colleges Notre Dame right now. Oh. Stolen puck by Notre Dame. Pass across. Right on it, 
sent wide. Hey, right on the side of the net more than anything is the Blazers get it out of the zone. Oh, oh. Oh. You see Notre Dame take a lot more risks here. They're making skip passes. They're going up the middle. They're trying to open up the ice a bit. <coughs> this one, what you're, you're, when you're the Blazers right now. You got to watch for that and capitalize. Sullivan, no effort to play the puck. So now it's five on three, albeit a very abbreviated five on three, eight seconds worth of Face-off won by Notre Dame. Back to the point it goes. Cantone has a look, sends it across. Filipousis, and that is stopped. Yeah, Ioannis uh, Filipousis had a sharp shot from a short distance, but was in on a bit of an odd angle. Uh, Yon Pavesio not really fooled by that shot. And that is cleared by Burnett. Brought back in by Notre Dame. Here's a wrister. No. That was ATN Pantone with the shot. Puck behind the Blazers goal. And it's played out to Chalot. Pass across. And Lalonde send it out in front. They score! A one-timer in front by Leon Chalut. It's a power play goal for Notre Dame. And the visitors are on the board here. It's three to one. Canal trying to come right back. And he goes into the net. The net goes off its moorings. No penalty. Which, you know, some of the fans to my right would probably tell you they did not expect the penalty called there. Not because they didn't believe it, but. Some folks over here have been very vocal in their approval and disapproval. It's all right. We're talking. I'd much rather hear you see, hey, sir, do you need a pair of glasses? That's one of those old chirps that just seem to disappear with time. PP. Oh, no! 
This is their fifth power play. Perez. Oh, he broke two sets of ankles there. Unfortunately, one of them was his own. Salut. Get on it! Going wide. Back to the point it comes, a shot block, and the Blazers get the puck out of there. Well, you see Muradov not afraid to handle the puck out there. Get after it! Now here's a pass down the wing. This shot, blocker save made by Pavesio. Sent over to an open wing. Notre Dame holds the play. Behind the goal it comes. One minute gone in the power play, 15 seconds between the game and the penalty clocks. And that's gonna get out. That's not how you draw up the perfect penalty kill, but you don't complain if that happens. Notre Dame's gotta reload. Final minute in the second period. Dabrowski a shot, but end save. Lalonde held the zone. A wrist shot deflects on the net. But it's gobbled up by Pivacio. Nicholas Stab, the captain for the team in the penalty box here after what some would say is a borderline penalty. Face off to the left of the Billings net here. With uh, 42.8 seconds left to go in the period. One by Notre Dame. Elevated over to the other side. Here's a wrist shot. Right into the chest of the Billings defender. 30 seconds left to go in this period. Notre Dame trailing 3 to 1. Back up. Chalou sends one across. Good feed. And that is knocked away by Craig. Good stick by the Blazers defenseman. Craig kicks it up, and Craig coming in. Craig's got 15. Craig trying to beat the buzzer. Somebody please remind me to edit that out here before. It <laughs> Well, the Blazers have a 3-1 lead. And it's time to flood the ice. We're coming back with a third. Welcome to the sports complex where Billings is looking to finish this baby off. 83-1. Here comes Notre Dame. Oh, what a start for Notre Dame. Billings scored seven seconds into the first. Notre Dame scores 14 seconds into the third. And baby, we have ourselves a brand new ball game. It's 3 2. Now, this is a turnover by the Blazers. And almost before, the Zamboni didn't even really officially get off, off the ice. That's how quickly that was. I mean, what a, what a start to this third period for Notre Dame. That's about as perfect as you could have a third period start if you're Notre Dame. So, look. Take it off the puck. Intercepted at the point by Notre Dame. Chipped off the boards but not out. Boche, Daibo. Daibo kicked it to himself. Dropped it back. And that's not gonna make the highlight moves anytime soon. They might for Notre Dame. It's padded aside. Get it Get it oh, we got an injured player on the far side. We're coming back. Here comes Notre Dame. Oh, a huge collision. And that'll be a penalty. And Scott Colosimo's got to look at. I don't know about taking a timeout here, but just giving the rest of the group on the bench uh, a little speech here. The wheels have fallen off for the Blazers. Remember, they were up 3 nothing 
and then a late goal in the second period, and now an early goal in the third, and now an early power play. And Colleys Notre Dame right now, one for five. They're going to work on power play number six here. Etienne Arister, and that's gloved. Yeah, they got to get back to playing the Blazers' way. They scored seven seconds into the game and pretty much have been in control. This game's about 35 minutes old, and it's 32 for Billings. Wow, what a big save by Fabricio. Yeah, I mean, Colleys Notre Dame pretty much. Billings has pretty much been the better team for 32 out of 35 minutes, and yet it's only a one-shot game here. Well, you know what you're doing if you're the Blazers? Just get back to that. Kill this penalty off and get back to playing the Blazers' edge. Chipped across to the other side. Arister, good block! Boone slides down and gets a skating away. <laughs> yeah, Scott Colosimo's not playing around. He's got Boone and Cannell up front here on the penalty kill. Saganiga now with Stigo on the back end along with Kylan Burnett. And that hits a stick and gets out of the zone. Face-off one by the Blazers. Sorry, the puck was picked up by the Blazers. Sorry about that, my uh, my daughter just spilt a drink over here, that's why I had to, sc oh, had to scramble. Yes. Right away comes Notre Dame, accelerating. Dropped back. Chalou, good feed through a stick. Twenty seconds to go in the power play. Perez, could he clear it? Shot, bad save, rebound, stick save. Pavicio with two huge stops. Will Pavicio with an unbelievable save. And that does it for the penalty, so Notre Dame one for six. The bad power advantage. Face off to the left of Fabacio. Face off. Picked up by Notre Dame. But Craig breaks it up. Craig coming in. Craig. Played right around the horn and Notre Dame will break out. Up to center ice. Good feed. And the Blazers with the steal. Turned over. Puck comes out in front of the net. And that'll be chip. And away comes Notre Dame, intercepted by the Blazers. Icing. Face off to the left of the Blazers' goal. Both teams are even. Four straight, five on five. Sent off the wall and that ricocheted like five times. If that was a game of hockey sack, that would have been great because the puck was literally hit like six times up the roof. Notre 
the stanch and Etienne picks it up here. Back to the point it goes. Stolen by the Blazers, McManus. Look at Barkley dashing in. He shoots and that's deflected on it. the lead to five too. today as well the uh, Blazers. And now the wake up the Blazers, two on one. Boone on the far side, near side, trying to get in. Canell's pass hit a leg. Boone again, he shoots that, hits the side of the net. Shoots tip, save, it out, save, Muradov kept it out three times. Stolen, save, Muradov without a stick. And now he gets it back. 
Third day. And Stern with the pickup. Brister, no. And that comes up to center ice. Intercepted by Notre Dame. Burnett banned on the clearing attempt and now it's sent back into Howard as building zone. Left to go here in the third. 5 2 Howard as Billings. Beat up. Tipped in by Altapayev. Ivan Potapayev trying to feed it out in front. That pass was blocked. Away comes Notre Dame. Drop pass. Pucks on edge and it's slapped right on. And the Blazers clear. It decided that it comes free. Oh, Notre Dame getting careless in their own zone. Shot over the top of the goal. On in front, St. Dave. And here come the Blazers. Chipped up the ice and the pass got too far for the intended target. In the high slot, save me, a rebound. Swept away, Craig, up the ice. Two on one, Blazers. Closer to refrigerator territory right now. Stolen by the Blazers. Out in front it comes, that pass is blocked. Back behind the goal it comes. Chipped up to center ice where McManus has it. McManus shoots it in, offside. That was a very late, obviously it was offside, but I mean, they, they were pretty late calling that. Or at least delayed. McManus. Ooh, to the point it goes, and this shot, that deflects in the Goes behind the Blazers goal. side of the net and then kicks out and it'll stay up and get out completely. Let's mark me. Bumped off the puck by Dabrowski and then 
Lex introduced himself to Jack Willaz. Sullivan survived the a hit coming. Caught a pie out. And he has it knocked away. And then, look at this. He got some rough stuff in there. Sullivan, Markley in there as well. Caught the pie out. Took the two to that originally. seven here. Power play number seven for Notre Dame. <coughs> they are one for six on the PP. And now Notre Dame resets. Goes to the point. And shot back in behind the Blazers, or near the Blazers net. Now with Cade at the top, set across, and the puck bounces away. Played across, point shot, tipped on net, kicked out, a rebound. Comes back to the point, a wrist shot, in intercepted. We pass, and here's a free play. The hair of the puck's chinny chin chin. Uh, that barely stayed up. Face off one by the Blazers. 37 seconds left to go in the penalty. I'm trying to figure out which Billings player will, will come out. Canelo tips it out. Canelo. Canelo takes it. Oh, he's kicked out. What a drive and what a pad soft by Muradov. And away comes Notre Dame. Salut! And he's turned away by Fabricio. Nicely waved. Stab. Stab in front. Stab! And follow up chance is blocked. And Salut's got it now for Notre Dame. Lex Markley. Five minutes left to go here. Big rugby scrum. Here's Scott Colosimo telling his troops, don't get wild here, boys. Cover it up here. 
Williams, Notre Dame. seven with the power play. throughout the day, or a penalty going, sorry. Their PK units can put to the test a lot today. Glove save. Like they're gonna get the dub here. Shot, Steve. Intercepted by Notre Dame. A shot blocked. Sullivan tried to read the press and just couldn't get in. play goal. They are two for eight on oh, the man advantage. 6-3 with uh, 2.54 to play here. Can't really say Pavisio had much of a chance here. So, 2.54 remaining and the Blazers have seen their lead cut to three. It's a 6-3 game. So that's blocked. Here's the 
There's a risk to it. Don't hit the net. Two minutes remaining in this contest. Tim, oh. open the lock. They couldn't bury it. Chip back to the point. Burnett Arister face off with 3.1. So the Blazers are going to get the win here. Amelia, don't put your heads in there. That's gross. And that is it. Blazers win. Blazers win. Blazers win. Saw the 20th anniversary of the 2003 Billings senior team, which won the Provincials. We see the present-day HSB senior team, which a bye in the opening round of the playoffs. That'll do it, your final score, Blazers. Six, college over name, 300.